Okay, everyone, World Tournament is here on Global. Hooray! Okay, everyone, so let's dive into this video. Yes, the World Tournament is here on Global. I hope you all are grinding it and having fun. World Tournament, everyone loves, right? We all love World Tournament. I'm so glad they uh, got rid of Chain Battle and not this. So let's hop into the rewards first. Um... Uh, on a serious note, they do give some pretty good uh, rewards for the World Tournament. You guys should go at least get all the missions done. I've been grinding. It is Friday uh, the 29th here. I've been grinding while at work today. So I got most of the missions done. I still need about 9 million points to get everything done. But I got my 20 wins in a row, all that good stuff. So everything is pretty much done for the missions. Me, personally, I do all the missions and then I get the hell out of there, dude. I'm not spending my whole weekend, my New Year's weekend, grinding this thing. I got stuff to do, man. I got family to hang out with and food to eat and football to watch no way i'm just grinding, grinding all weekend for this man with all the uh just with everything going on with global dokkan i mean if you want to go for it and grind 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 you be my guest man but the rewards are not that great for getting like you know top 1000 in the world uh, or even top like one local i mean Here's the prizes this year. You get Jackie Chun, which is kind of cool. You can finish the LR and stuff. You get some good Awakening medals and items there for the shop. Tickets, more Dragon Stones, but um, you have the good shot at getting first place locally. I mean, as long as you grind quite a bit. But for the rankings, I mean, this is incredible, man. I mean, if you do end up grinding this thing, like, all weekend long and you are go hard and you actually do well and, you know, place in the top 100, you will get some good stuff. I mean, SSR tickets, uh, statues, Kai's, the rainbow, um, announcer medal to awaken some of the world tournament units. But I just, dude, I just do not see the, ho the whole why. I just don't, like, why would you want to waste that much time doing the th same thing over and over and over and over and over and over again just for a very small reward? I mean, we're going to get this stuff in the future, so... It's up to you guys. Grind as much as you want. My suggestion is do all your uh, missions, get them done. Because there's some good stuff in just these regular missions, and anyone can do these, right? We are going to be going over teams and stuff today, too, so stay tuned. But um, you get a lot of Grand Kai's and Elder Kai's at the end, Dragon Stones, tickets to summon. Um, I already did most of my ticket summons, which I realized I should have waited till I got home to do that, but that's okay. Um, I pulled some good stuff. I, I pulled some stuff I needed, but. We're going to go into um, an actual run here, and I'm going to show you guys what I typically do for these events. Um, I typically bring them both the same team. Now, there's people that bring strictly LRs to raise your team cost to get better you know, point distribution at the end. Um, as you can see right now, I have a 21 win streak, and my victory points are 1.5, or times 1.5 extra, so that's kind of cool. But if I go just in the preliminary here, I will show you the team that I always run. So first of all, we always bring a extreme STR um, Broly here, because Broly is kind of the king still of World Tournament, just because if there's a Goku's family on me, which you're going to be facing 90% of the time in these World Tournaments, you get super effective against all types, and he does an additional super attack that hits everyone, right? But this is normally the team I run. I have no issues ever with this team. Sometimes you have to use a Ghost Usher, and that's okay, but mo for most times you're going to be good on key. Um, I'm bringing Bulma for support, but Cell, Vegeta, Nappa, Krillin, and Broly, and Broly can all do attack everyone attacks, right? That's the whole point. You want to get everything done in one turn, I'll show you guys what I mean here, but let's dive into the preliminary here. I, uh, just getting my 21 wins or whatever I'm at, 20 wins, I, it's not fun, dude. World Tournament, they need something different, man, they really do. Um... When it comes to World Tournament, you do it for the rewards and the missions, kind of like ch we were doing for Chain Battle, but they're scrapping that idea and getting that out of there. But like right off the bat, see, we have Cell here, and he's going to do the majority of the work here. We have a Goku's family. Oh, actually, no, we don't in this one. That's okay. So we're going to be just fine. But I'm going to put Cell in slot one, then uh, Vegeta and Nap can sit in the slot three. And honestly, this is it. This is World Tournament. Are you having fun yet? I'm glad you aren't, because no one is. <laughs> They could do so much fun stuff with the World Tournament idea. I, like, I like the concept, but they just need to they need to revamp it, man. This has been the same since, gosh, I swear, like, year two. It's just, like, it's it's boring, dude. And this first stage is really uh, tedious because you have to face three other fights. Not just You're not just against one person. You're facing three other members, which is just unfortunate. It's not like I'm playing against any real person. Uh, these are all, you know, just computers with uh, teams, right? 
So now we have uh, Broly in rotation. I'm gonna actually link him with um, Bulma there, because Bulma's gonna get a hopefully get us some support. There we go. Now for this, I will use a Ghost Usher just in case, because if you do get hit with a super attack, you are losing. Like no doubt in my mind that we would lose if we get a super. It's very unlikely that you do get super, but you, if you're going for the, all the missions done and you want to get 20 in a row, just use a Ghost Usher, man, uh, or use a Whis or something, just in case. You never know. You don't want to get to like 18 wins in a row, then have try to take a risk it, like risk it for the biscuit, and get screwed, right? Then you have to go all the way back from zero, up to 20 wins. But so we got that fight done. As you can see, we're having really, really no issues at all, like whatsoever, with um, key or members or anything. Because I got I got items right here. I can up my key if I don't get my full uh, 18 key there. I'm also gonna use a Ghost Usher. This is our last fight. I just don't want to die in this video. Then we will give Krillin these, and most of the time, 99% of the time, Broly will be doing all the heavy work, so no worries at all, really, it's not too bad. But, team options, as you can see, Broly, Cell, Vegeta, Nappa are very good, Krillin's very good. Um, I'm bringing the Goku as a leader, but you can also bring Genyu. Um, Genyu is probably a better option, I just like bringing a Goku because I like the character. Um, Piccolo Jr., so good, man, for the World Tournament. I'm going with a strict LR team just to get my team cost up, and I'm not really having too many issues this World Tournament with, uh, you know, getting things done, but it's up to you guys. It really is. There's a lot of good units. Um, we'll go over a kind of a whole team build here as soon as we're done with this whole round here. It's going to go very quick, but I just kind of want to show you guys my run through and what I do for World Tournament, but really it's the same thing every time these stupid things come back around to Global. It's just the same team. Find uh, LR STR Broly like it's been for years, and then just click buttons, and that's it. <laughs> like, that's that's honestly it, man. Nothing too special, but hopefully this guide helps someone out. If you're, if you're new to World Tournament, or if you're new to the game, or you're trying to get into World Tournament for the first time, we'll go over a nice team build for you. I'll try to stick with, like, free-to-play players or units and stuff like that, but a lot of this is... Uh, it's going to help. Even if you don't have an STR LR Broly yourself, you've never pulled one, you can use one as a friend always because the friend leader skill does not matter in the world tournament. It just matters on what you're bringing for your character, right? But you do not have to bring all LRs. I'm doing this, again, to raise my team cost so I can get better points and just get the, get the missions done as quickly as possible because once I get 30 uh, million points total, I'm getting the hell out of here, dude. I got better stuff to do. I got some Pokemon to play. I got some football to watch. got New Year's to celebrate. Like... We are done with this tonight. I do not want to have to worry about this over the weekend. But now we are going into the um, semi-final round. And be careful. I have seen a couple uh, LR STR Brolies not easy aid. So make sure that they have an SA of 25. As you guys just saw. But I'm also going to put my Broly as a friend. Uh, or the friend supporter. Um, he's link level 10. Fully rainbowed. Good equips. Um, all that good stuff. So he's specifically my Broly is set up for the world tournament. With uh, basically crits, a little bit of dodge, and then additionals too, just to make sure things get done. Besides the World Tournament, dude, I never use this Broly, unfortunately. I just, I, I don't. Do not want Bulma to get a support. Perfect. Now, the one thing I will say, if you're using STR Broly, make sure that you try to just stick within below 18 key. His 18 key super only attacks one character, as his 12 key will attack everyone. Um... Which, it's not the biggest deal, because even if you get an 18 key super attack, he will do an additional 12 key super attack, but it's just better to be safer than sorry, right? Especially if you're going for the 20 wins in a row mission. Or if you're grinding to get, like, top rank. Good luck to you, but... Just to be as efficient as possible. So we're still going, we're still going, we're still going. And we are already on our final round here. So I'm going to go ahead and click final. And we'll just wrap this up, so... Hopefully, uh, this goes quickly, but a full round does not take too long. Like I said, I did this while I was busy at work today, just kind of in the background. Not too hard. Just make sure you're kind of just moving and you're looking at the screen every now and then. On the final stage, I do like to try to get these Awakening Medals just to collect them and have as many on deck as I can. Do I need them? Probably not, but it's always nice to have them just in case I do need them later in the future. Which looks like we'll get one more for sure here. And then we'll probably go face him. Yep. So let's end this just for the video. I don't want it to be, to be too long for you guys. So I'm going to put uh, Nappa and Vegeta up here. Yeah, let's do that. I'm going to put 
Broly at this key. I'm going to use a Ghost Usher just in case. Which we already got our 20 wins in a row. So it doesn't really matter if we did get uh, super attacked right there and we died. But again, I don't want to lose out on the points. I don't want to restart because it does break your streak as well. So Vegeta and Nappa probably won't finish everyone. Unless it's a tech character at the end here. I didn't even look. Yeah, they didn't... Oh, we got an additional super though. That's kind of cool. So hopefully we can just take everyone out here. That'd be nice. Please, that would be nice. All right, good job. So there you have it. That was a full round. Now, if you're just starting from scratch, 19 more in a row, and you are good to go. You got most of your missions done. They can, then you can just kind of casually go not pay as much attention. But let's go over some team build ideas for you guys. So let me uh, let me hop out of here. Got a ticket there. but So this, is, again, is the team I'm running. I'm bringing uh, LR Goku. As a leader, Broly, Vegeta Nappa, Krillin, uh, Bulma for support, and Cell. Now, your key is attack all units, right? You want attack all units. So if we go to character list here, let's just take a look at the LRs quick. You saw most of them that I had, but um, another good option would be if you're struggling for units and you happen to have... Um, where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Vegeta here, his 18 key, that's the only reason I didn't bring him. His 18 key can hit everyone. Also, this Vegeta up here, Majin Vegeta, where is he? There he is. He, his 18 key can hit everyone as well. So, again, I normally don't bring them because they typically struggle with key. And it's really annoying for me to get their 18 key. And I just have better units that are available. So that's why I'm not bringing them. But some good uh, TURs you can also bring, obviously, are going to be... Let's go to Extreme Fizz. This Broly right here. A lot of people have this unit. I have him easy aid. He's uh, Link level 10. He's actually not rainbowed. I, wow. I haven't pulled a fourth copy of him yet. Well, but he hits everyone and he hits very hard. So if you you don't have SDR Broly, this is a solid option as well. Again, I'm trying to bring the full LR team just to get my team cost up to get better points. But you do as you please. Then obviously one of my favorite units of all time on release is this guy right here. I have him sitting at 79%. Uh, level 10 links, good equips. But my junior here, whoo! He will guarantee you a win. So if you're if you're a newer player, but you manage to pull him somehow, put him on your team. Like if you're struggling for units, this guy is phenomenal, dude. He will get the job done. Like no problem, no problem. But that is just some idea, guys. Uh, just some ideas for you on teams and kind of how it goes. But world tournament, let's be honest, kind of sucks. It's not that fun. It's boring, but it has good missions, so get them done. And hopefully this video helped you guys. If it did, please don't be afraid to drop a like down below. Subscribe if you guys are new. I provide daily Dokkan content as well as some Pokemon stuff on the side. But um, just showing some support lets me know I'm doing a good job and you guys enjoy the content I'm putting out. So thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Get to grind in the World Tournament. Get at least, at least all the missions done, man. New Year's is right around the corner. I'll have more videos coming. All right, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great, great weekend. Take care. Bye, guys.